Hi, and welcome to a special edition of Inside Jayco. My name is John McDonald, and today we're going to share with you some of the elements of our quality assurance program. One of the reasons we have the confidence to offer you a two-year warranty on every Jayco RV is because of the myriad of tests that we put the units through, not only as they go down the production line, but before we even begin to assemble them. A couple of the post-production tests that we do, we're going to talk about today, and sharing his thoughts with us on those is Marlon Lehman. Marlon, if you would, first of all, let's talk about the camping audit. Share with us a little bit about what that is and what it involves. The uh, camping audit basically consists of what a customer does. And so there's some water testing that goes on, propane tests, you fire up all the appliances, correct? Correct. We yes. test every appliance as there is. Uh, the reefer gets cold on electric and gas. Okay. The doors and drawers open and close, make sure they latch. Uh, all the shower surrounds your no leaks. Anyway, it functions, it's tested. Marlon, can you give us an idea of how many camping audits you would do on a given day? On an average day, we'll run uh, five to six units through. And then the units that go through the camping audit, my understanding is those also go over to what we call our rain booth and they're given a rain test. That's correct. Can you share a little bit about that with us? We do a test for 10 minutes and four and a half inches of rain is what that compares to. Wow. That's a lot of water. Yeah. And then when that test is done, I actually go in and we actually check all the windows, anything that's on the outside, outside recept or trunk or whatever goes on the outside, we make sure it doesn't leak. Ten minute rain test, four and a half inches of water converts into what per hour? 27 inches. And how many units do we do in a year roughly? 1,200. 1,200. Now we're going to head over to Plant 20 Lamination and talk about some of the tests that we do over there. We're here at Plant 20, which we refer to as Lamination. This is where all of our walls, roofs, and floors go through what we call the vacuum bonded lamination process. This is Carl Miller, who's one of our two quality assurance managers. Carl's going to take us through the plant and show us a few of the tests that they undertake in order to ensure that we're putting out a quality product. All right, yeah, let's go check it out. Thank you, Carl. We do uh, water and glue tests. Basically, we will take uh, uh, sample boards. We will actually put the uh, sample boards into our lamination uh, bead applicator. We'll measure those uh, three times a day. The same process goes with the water as well. It's very important that we continually monitor that to ensure that we have the, uh, the correct amount of, of uh, water and glue on our, our substrates. Uh, secondly is the peel test. Uh, every wall that is produced we will actually ensure that the bond between the fiberglass and the Luan is stronger than the actual Luan itself. Thirdly is the, the heat box test. We'll take samples of those same walls, heat it to 175 degrees for about eight hours, and then we'll turn and take that same uh, sample and we'll put it into our freezer and we'll take it down to zero degrees for eight hours and we'll cycle that for a three day period. Uh, those are some of the main things that we will monitor uh, on, a, on a weekly basis, on a daily basis. But ultimately, uh, there's, there's tons and tons of checks that we, uh, that we uh, do, as well as uh, this document, to ensure that three years from now, we're going to know exactly what happened to your wall and, and, and uh, help us to continually improve our, our product and our processes. And that's it for this edition of Inside Jayco. Hopefully, we've given you a little insight into some of the tests that we do to ensure that we're building a quality product. I'm John McDonald. Thanks for joining us. Hope you learned something. Hope to see you next time.